Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. <sighs> so tired. But let's chat today about what we should be packing for our dogs when we're going on a day trip. So we've been doing a lot of day trips because we've been just exploring. As you might already know, we relocated several months ago and we moved from Thailand to Europe. So I know a lot of you are wondering, where did we move? Well, let me tell you, we moved to Poland. So naturally we've been exploring different places and just doing day trips and sometimes weekend trips. So we've been out and about a lot. And a lot of the times we're able to bring Lambo with us, but Mango can't always come with us, especially on the train. Birds are just not allowed on the train, but dogs of all animals are allowed. Cats are also not allowed. So we've been taking Lambo to a lot of different places. He's been to forests, he's been to beaches, he's been to other cities. I'm gonna show you what I pack for him every time we do a day trip. And I pack the same things when we do a short little quick weekend trip, just to make sure that I have everything for him to make sure that he's good, right? Right, Lambo? I'm just walking around the house collecting stuff to show you guys of everything that we pack. Okay, so I got all this stuff together. It's on the table. It's a big disaster. So let's take a look and organize it. So as you can see, there's a lot on the table. Some of these are standard essentials and some of them are extras. So let's go over that. So let's take a look at all of the essentials. So these are the things that I will always bring. A leash and harness, a pop-up bowl, usually two of them, one for water and one for food. I always bring a toy or two. He loves to play ball, so I love to bring this soccer ball, but this is one of his favorites and it's a little bouncy. So always toys and a food bowl. And with the food bowl, I'm also gonna bring some fresh water and a little bit of food. So these are these little packets, but I also like to bring a little meat snack. So this is a beef stick and they come in different kinds. So I like to make sure I have a little snack for him and some treats as well. So that's just a mixture. I'll show you guys what's in there. Then I also like to bring these little wipes. So these are just little wet wipes for dogs and it's for their paws, coat and tail. So I like to use these to wipe them down if he gets dirty. Now if it's a really hot day, I also like to make sure that I have some electrolytes. So this tells you how much your dog should have based on their weight and size. So he can have about half a bottle, maybe a little bit more of this based on his weight and size and electrolytes are gonna be really good, not only for GI support, but also to hydrate him if he's running around, having a really fun time on our adventure, obviously a little bandana to make him look cute. And I like to bring him this little like, it's like a blanket or towel, so he can cuddle up with it or sit on it on the train, or if he gets wet, I can dry him off a little bit. So yeah, these are our essentials. Lambo, you would just look so cute with this on. I told you you'd look so cute. Lambo. Oh. So I like to put together a little treat bag just to have treats when he's being a good boy or a little just treat. Who doesn't love a treat on an adventure? So in there, I've got um, some immunity treats that are insect with ginger. Now I love this brand because their ingredients are pretty good. Then we've got Riley's Organic Bones, and these are the minis. It's the pumpkin coconut recipe. And then I've got these chicken coins that are with insect and enriched with coconut oil. Shrimps enriched with hemp, anti-stress bones. So in case he might be feeling a little bit stressed, these are gonna be good to de-stress him. But in addition to that, I have to mention that I always bring this rescue remedy, these drops. Now I've talked about this during travel, we've used it and whenever Lambo has anxiety. So if he's gonna have anxiety, then I know that these are going to help him. Lately, he's not been having any anxiety, so it's been great, but I like to have these on hand if we're out and about 
or on a car ride, on a train ride, whatever, to make sure he's good. This is another essential for us to have. Now, let's talk about all of the extras that I was mentioning. So, one of the extras is Flea Hex from Dr. Tobias, and this is just a plant-based spray to prevent fleas and ticks and basically bugs. So, I like to bring this if we're going into a forest or we're going on an adventure somewhere in the woods or some bushy grasslands. So, it just depends where you're going. So, if you're going somewhere in the forest, that's a good one to bring. If we're going somewhere for a night, I make sure to bring him more food. So, instead of bringing just one of these little sachets, I just bring a whole can of meat goods for him. If we're going to a beach, I like to bring his little towel so that I can dry him off really good. This works amazing and it's so cute. So that is for a beach adventure. Additionally to the beach, I like to bring his little hat and he just looks so cute in it. And last but not least, I always check the weather and if wherever we're going to be, I see that there's overcast or the weatherman is calling for rain, then I pack his little rain jacket and of course, he looks super adorable in this as well. So yeah. actually gonna be going on a day adventure. So let's pack it up. Just like that, we're packed and we're ready to go. So that's it for today, guys. I hope that you liked this video. Don't forget to tap that like button and hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys in the next video. You